Mission Builders International came in to our church and said, hey, we just need some people, need some technical people. Do you have electrical backup? Yeah, I do. Well, it'd really be nice. And I'm thinking, hey, Lord, <laughs> hey, I think you're calling. <laughs> I taught um, one of the leaders here in a DTS in Paris, and he was leading a DTS, invited me to come down, and that was the beginning of our journey to Mutzlan. So we work out of our church in Canada for six months, and then as soon as those days are up, we come here, and we love being here. I think the value that we can bring that are our age and or maybe part of the foundational um, generation in YWAM is that you have a perspective and you know the story. And we, we, we understand a lot of the things that younger people are now going through. And so just, just the value of coming and sharing out of your life story, I think, and then the fact that you take time for someone because programs, a lot of people, they get really busy. And then when you have someone who comes just takes time for you, the impact is really, really wonderful. And you can see the fruit from it. Part of, a, part of being a community of young people is invigorating for us older folk. Um, so uh, it's, it's been a joy to be connected with them, to be part of their community. And uh, this base truly is a community. We always feel like family when we arrive. Uh, we're welcomed like family and we're treated like family. Our role here has been a variety of things, just to serve in whatever way we can. We pioneered and planted churches, we started YWAM ministries, led schools, and all of that is great, but we hit a grandparent stage of ministry. And what we learned is, is there comes a time when it's no longer time to run the ministry. You need to let younger people do that. And the, the value that we bring at our age is that we're spiritual grandparents, and that, that calls really more just a love and enjoy the children, encourage them, teach them from your experience. So often people will talk to us about the wisdom we have, and uh, the wisdom we have comes from the Lord, obviously, uh, but I think what they're saying is we have lots of experience, and so we share our experiences with them, which help them uh, walk through things that they're going through. For many young people, it's the first time away from home. Some of them are from across the world and so there are times when they just need somebody to come alongside and, and put an arm around their shoulder, give them a hug and say, you know, you're doing okay. The faith here in YWAM is so strong um, and, and when I come here I feel that I, I the, the Spirit, Holy Spirit is, is coming into me more than it would otherwise. and. Um, so I always look forward to that too, a, a boost in my, um, my faith. Uh, and that's, a, that's what I most take home. That and the discussions with the young people at dinner time, uh, those, are, those are golden times for me. It gets boring just sitting around the house, you know, and um, you, you, don't, you really don't want to take on a big ministry anymore, but you know you still have really some valuable things to contribute. Well, in YWAM Mount Salon, you can come like we have. We're spending a month here, which is perfect for our life and our schedule. They have a wonderful apartment. We have a, we're on the fifth floor with a great view of the ocean. And we just go and hang out with people all day long. We come back, have a nice sleep. And uh, it's, it's, just, it's just a great opportunity. Uh, you can invest into the schools. You can invest into uh, every aspect of people's lives and a comfortable way that will work with your life today. God makes you who you are. God puts gifts into every one of us and, and those gifts are to be shared. And so I would encourage anybody, I, I think that when you're older, when you retire, we haven't actually retired yet, but we, we feel we have been retreaded, you know, like they retread tires. That's what, that's what being in Mexico has done for us. It has given us a purpose. I would love to call the people that I worked with and say, there's a place for you in YWAM Mazalan. YWAM Mazalan wants um, the older generations of YWAMers to come and to bring their experience to support and to care for the, the future generations of missionaries.